The Arizona Super Show had just wrapped up. A chance to see countless lowriders up close. It's a tradition that dates back decades here in the Valley. And thanks to a sun superstar, a new generation may be picking up the mantle. The sophisticated few car club lowriders are lined up at Raposo Park in South Phoenix on this May night. Throughout the Southwest, it's, it's a love. The park lights hitting the hoods offer a hint of what the full light reveals to be works of art, as the cars are themselves. Rick Reese is the vice president of the club. He grew up with it. The lowrider life is in his blood. My parents were into the lowriding. Uh, they used to cruise Central when I was a kid. The car club is one of the oldest in Phoenix, established back in 1974. And Carlos Mena is passing that tradition on. My son is a member now. He has a, his own car. My daughter, you know, she when she was little, they had bikes and, and pedal cars. According to some historians, the first low riders arrived in Phoenix in the 1950s. What it means to these collectors is pride and hard work. For me, it's it's showcasing my art piece that has had my blood, sweat, and tears over the last 13 years. If some of these cars look familiar to you, there's a good reason for that. You may have seen them on Phoenix Sun superstar Devin Booger's Instagram when he teamed up with the car club to help foster children in Arizona. Each member has purchased gifts for the kids. Anna Barrios founded Roman Home LLC for foster kids. She said when the kids saw Debo pull up in his lowrider, they raced to say hello. The kids have a memory that they'll never forget. They still have the autographs that they talk about till this day. In the past, this tradition has gotten a bad rap. When people think of lowriders, what do you think they think of? Uh, they think that, uh, you know, we, we got it by some kind of illegal means or we didn't work for it. But these guys do. It's an expensive and at times waning art with cruising now banned on many popular valley roads. But with D-Book's seal of approval, the low and slow lifestyle is catching on with a whole new generation. Some very beautiful cars, man. You know what I mean? For him to come out and yeah. bring one of them, it was amazing. All right, the sophisticated few celebrating their 49th anniversary, May 27th at American Legion Post 41. And by the way, they're inviting the whole community to come out. They say it's just going to be a good time. Look at the cars, their works of art. And also downtown Glendale, that's still a really popular place where low riders can go on certain nights. Are we going? Oh, let's go. I am because so excited. I didn't see any shots of you in there riding. Didn't they let you ride? You know what? I was scared to get in because there's so much work that they put into it. Like, what if I got something dirty? I don't know. I was scared to well, touch it. Well, this them. time, now that you have the connection. Yes. Stay tuned. We we're said we're going to put our shades. Yeah. <laughs> Leather jackets looking cool. I love it.